So these are the, the books that my five-year-old is currently using. So it's a mix of kindergarten, grade one, grade two, depending on the subject. Um, the first thing we have, this is actually out of an old book we had before from my oldest daughter, but this is just numbers one to a hundred and we she's just underlining ones that she knows and ones that she needs to work on and then ones that we're working on together. So that's part of her math for counting. And then um, I got them these books from the dollar store. They're only $4. And then there's different topics. So Bible we have, writing, reading, math. And then this is just extra for, so for extra. And we have like chores and manners and then chore lists and things like that. So for this, the first topic, we have Bible. So, so far she's... We just got these, so she hasn't done much, but... So the first one, she just does really simple things. We just read a story together from this book, actually, right here. It's very old, so it's kind of torn up a bit. Um, so it's just simple stories. Just very simple stories. We got this from the thrift store a long time ago. So it's just very simple stories, a few pages long. And then... So we just do basically a simple question, What it, like she tells me what she learned from it, and we talk about it together, and then three Bible words that she picked out, and then three things she's thankful for. So just continues on. This one we haven't done yet. And then we have writing. So she's just, we're actually using this book right here. This was my oldest daughter's book, and then I'm just rewriting it out actually. You don't have to do that. You can probably order these on, I don't know, maybe Amazon or something. These are actually from Dollarama, but I haven't seen them anymore. That's why I haven't gotten other ones. So you can probably order them online somewhere. They're only maybe $1.25, so. but they're really good for beginning stuff. So this is just my oldest dollars one from when she used it. So now I'm just writing out basically the same thing, these words, just writing out here. And then she just fills it in on here and writes it out. And then the words that she can read, we just check mark them off. And then as she learns to read more, we'll check mark more off. And then we have reading. So we do about four sentences each day, something similar like that, blend letters here. And then the words she doesn't know, I'll circle, and then we write them down, and we practice those words. The words she knows, we'll just underline. And we have math. So here she was just learning numbers and writing numbers. And any she didn't get, she just rewrote them out again to practice. And similar here, although we haven't got to this one, but we did do this part here. So writing numbers that are bigger. And then ones that are smaller so I actually she hasn't done this one um, but she'll just choose the bigger number than the smaller number so really simple stuff and then so for the math one actually we use this one the grade one math so it's just basically what I was showing you although some parts she might not be ready for so we don't do the top but we're doing the bottom or anything that she's ready for so counting and stuff and then also for the reading one, sorry, I missed that one. For the reading, we're using grade two reading as well. And so it's just basic things, pretty much the same thing, just without the pictures. So right here and then right here. And then she's just here, we're reading it here. It was just filling the letters. So it's a bit, a little bit different, but very similar. So these books are all from Homeroom Canadian Workbooks, and I don't know where you can, oh, I guess you can visit their website, um, telegraph.road.com, rd.com, so you can probably get them there. But these are really good workbooks. I found they were really helpful, and um, yeah, and also, so that's that. And then for Bible, we have this one, of course, which I showed you guys. So the very simple one. But we also go over it because it gives us the verse. So we also go over the verses. See, as you can see, it gives you the verse. 
We also go over the verses in her actual Bible. So, let me just... Okay, I can't open this with one hand, but her Bible's in here, so... Just a regular King James Bible. It's not like any kid's Bible or anything. It's just a regular Bible. And so we go over it and we read it together in that. And then we also have... Um, she has a few reading books here. They're very old books. A lot of our books are pretty used up, but... Um, just basic. This, this one is poems. So, just for learning to read. Just simple things. And then... This one she's doing right now. My sister will probably recognize this book because her son has the same one, if you're watching. So, those are her reading books right now that she's working on. I actually, for I actually forgot this one. Um, this is just a small little book she has. Um, I think we got it from Dollar Tree many, many years ago. And it's just parables. Very simple versions of some parables so she can just learn those and and then she has this gospel track it seems really random but she really likes this gospel track it just basically gives you a very simple outline of if I can open it with one hand of the gospel and has a few pictures in it so these are these are actually ones that she used to like to hand out but right now we can't really do it as much so but she this is one she likes to read for homeschool just a basic of the gospel and then the last thing we have are just her flashcards. so it's subtracting and adding this is just basic stuff um she's not really ready for some of this yet but some of them we're doing up to about maybe five right now for adding and subtracting and then so I got these at, um, I believe it was Walmart or the dollar store. Either way, they have the, they usually have these pretty cheap. Usually, like, they're a dollar or two. Not too much. And then we have these cards that we also got, um, I think from Walmart as well. And on the back are just some, uh, words that we've written out, um, just on, uh, cards. So all these words, the ones that are checkmarked are the ones she knows. And then I think she mo knows most of these ones now. These are pretty old. But, and then these are just simple words. This is actually the, the it says potato, that's for the back. It has a picture on it too. And then it's in French as well. And then this would, she guesses what it is. And then on the back it says the word and then you read the word and then, and then all the cards are like that. So it's just reading and and pictures and also learning a bit of French as well for starters and that's everything that basically everything that we use and then I just put it all in this bin just a simple bin from the dollar store and that's it thank you for watching and um, I think I'll do a preschool and possibly a grade three four-ish one at some point when I get to it. Okay, bye.